Hello Darts Nuts, I'm going to do a review of a set of high darts. Um, these are at 85% tungsten dart and this is the A model. They only have a few models out at present. And these retail for 38 euros which is about £29. Uh, this is a 15.5 gram barrel. and. It comes in this very neat little box, but um, it's barrels only, and as you can see inside, it comes in a kind of a crystal square block, which is really quite cool. Um, I've not seen darts packaged in something like this before, and it's um, quite a cool little thing. And obviously inside you've got the holes and you just tip your barrels out. Almost like something you would use as an ornament really. Obviously my fingers have uh, muckied it a little bit but it's a nice little uh, thing to hold the darts in that. And like I said it's, it's just barrels only. 85% um, tungsten. So that's basically what you get inside the box so we'll have a close look at the barrels now alright I've just stuck some soft tip points and stems on that I got with the high darts board and as you can see it's a strip barrel dart but it has a very nice grippy ring section and it's quite nice to see a soft tip barrel like this because quite a lot of the ones that I tend to see they often seem to be made for rear grippers, whereas this one has got a very nice grip at the front for front grippers like me. Um, that is quite grippy actually. I'd say it's a high level of grip that. And it's quite a nice looking straightforward design but quite neatly done. Obviously a lot of manufacturers now are starting to supply the barrels only because basically people tend to use their own uh, points and stems and what have you. So tends to be the reason why a lot of them are doing it but uh, yeah, quite a nice little barrel that. Alright, I'll just let you look at it for a little bit, then I'll put the detailed picture up with all the measurements. Okay, here's the detailed picture. The darts are smooth at the front of the barrel of about 4mm, and then you've got the main section of grip, which is made up of these double thin cut rings with quite a wide space in between each set. That's 24mm wide and the rear of the barrel is smooth and that's 14.5 millimeters wide the overall length is 42.5 millimeters and the width is 6.4 millimeters all right i'll take some measurements along the barrel it's quite a short barrel it's only 42.5 millimeters long and i'll measure the width of that smooth section first that says 6.612 6 and I'll see if I can grab the ring section it's a little bit wider there but it's probably because of the edges of the rings it's kind of hard to grip onto them I'll do it that way yeah so it's about 6.4 I would say 6.4 millimeters is the widest and I'm just trying to uh, look with my eyes closer here. I'm not sure whether that section there, I'll just measure that here first. Yeah, I think it kind of goes thinner there as it gets to the end of the barrel. Yeah, so it slightly tapers down, right down to 6mm at the barrel and at the front, but obviously it's got two beer thread either side, so you could throw the barrel from either end really 5.97 
and I'll just uh, measure the depth of that 8.61 so it's drilled out 8.61 and the rear is drilled out 8.2 so there's not a lot drilled out either side but it is only a short barrel anyway alright I'll just wear the barrels then see how they match that is 15.51 15.46 and 15.52 so pretty close and if I was to use a setup similar to this the full weight would be 17.57 grams alright I'll see if I can find the balance point with nothing attached no points or stems etc the balance is it's probably just around about there so it's pretty much in the centre and if I was to attach the point it falls off yeah it moves just a little bit up not a lot um, with the medium stems and standard shape flights it moves quite a bit more to the rear with that setup so that's the detail look at the high darts barrel A let's give them a throw and see how they go As it's only a short barrel, I'm holding it at the front, but uh, it's not really too far from the middle of the barrel. But uh, I do quite like the grip on this. It's got a nice positive edgy ring grip to it and really helps to throw the dart easier, especially with it being so light. Um, I've tried uh, a few light darts now and some seem to work okay, it just depends on the shape, but this one it seems to be flying quite flat um, nothing wrong with that um, I think it's quite a decent dart for a front gripper like me as opposed to a lot of the uh, Asian barrels that I've tried where the grip is quite often on the rear um, it's quite nice to be able to grip one from the front and have a nice feel to it but you don't really see that many that are a classic straight barrel design in soft tip, especially not from the Asian side. You probably see quite a lot more on the European and US side, but uh, I haven't really played with too many straight barrel soft tip darts, so it's quite nice to throw these and I'm quite impressed with them so far. I think it's the grip more than anything that's uh, making it a nice feel. So I'll just have a few more throws from that front, mid front position. If you're a flat thrower as well, I think these will be pretty good. I tend to be a kind of a loopy thrower, but these these are fly, flying really flat. So 
just for the sake of experiment then I'll just uh, try throwing it well I'd say it's in the middle of the dar but it's right on the end of the grippy section so I'll just give it a throw from there Felt like I had more zip behind it. Have a couple of more. Yeah, pretty good that from that position. I think because you're closer to the balance of the dart or maybe just slightly behind it from there getting a bit more oomph behind the dart seem to be flying a little bit quicker and a little bit harder so again if you're a flat throw and you like gripping it around there probably suit you even better um, I'm going to try the rear grip but there is no actual grip on that section it's just smooth but again just for the sake of experimenting I'll give it a try from there Control it from there. I wouldn't say it would be terrible for a rear gripper, but I think front and middle grippers will probably get the best benefit from the dart. I'll have one more go from there. times but uh, the fact is that there's no grip on that rear section it's only smooth so I would say middle and front grippers will probably like it the best but um, I'm just gonna go back to that middle grip again I just want to have a couple of more throws from there I do think that's the best spot on this dart, like... Yeah, I think it's a pretty good dart for a middle gripper, but... I was quite happy with the front grip, but from there, I just feel like as if... I got a little bit more oomph behind it, so it feels quite nice to throw from there. So there you go, that's the high darts barrel A, 85% tungsten dart. It's got a very nice uh, edgy wing grip on it, and like I say, it's nice to see a straight barrel soft tip dart. Um, I still kind of prefer a little bit heavier in the weight, but uh, after a while, you tend to get more used to the lighter dart, but. It's just because I'm used to throwing the uh, slightly heavier steel tip darts, but uh, it's not a bad dart at all there. I think front grippers will be fine, but I think middle grippers will probably like it the best. Just feels just right from that position. Rear grippers, it'll probably work fine for a rear gripper, but if you need grip, you haven't got nothing there. It's only on this section of the barrel. So, there you go. That's the end of the review. Thanks for watching.